Oh, it's a box. I wonder if it's got any gold coins in it. My lovers, oh, I'm in that garden today. Yes, it's quite a big garden looking at it. Yeah, it's the chicken run. Chickens died, unfortunately, got too old and pegged it. Right, so I'm in this reasonably large garden, so it might take more than one day. So let's see what I can find. Oh, I've got something here, my lovers. It's like a bit of a spoon. It's like solid silver, is it? No, it's a pewter spoon. Imagine sticking a bit of lead in your mouth. Ugh. That wouldn't be very good, would it? See if it bend like lead. We can't have not much lead in it because it's not very bendable. Ugh. Right, there it was. There's the handle and there's going to open up into the bowl. I'll see if the rest of it's nearby. Oh, look at this sweet signal I got here. I reckon that was that's a dropped coin. And recently dropped as well. Oh. Or perhaps not. Perhaps it's a hinge. Oh, it's a nice big chunk of metal though, isn't it? Look at that. That gave me a lovely signal. Nice big bit, huge piece of bronze. Lovely. Oh, look at this signal I got here. Quite big. Is it the other half of that hinge? Mm. That looks lovely. Thirteen forty-six. That could be a silver coin or a two pence piece, more likely. Ah, oh, nope. Well, it could be a buckle. <laughs> yeah, it could be a buckle. Yeah, D buckle. Right, on to the next. Cool, look at this signal I got here. What I'm going to do now, my lovers, is I'm going to oscillate the coil. Right, I reckon that's two objects next to each other. There's the one object. Right, this is the S. If there's anything else in there. 
No, that was it. What was doing that was probably because it's an unusual shape. Yeah, it's probably the unusual shape that was making me, making me think it was two objects. Right, it's a flower. It's a bit weird, isn't it? It's got a hole in the top. Oh, it's got a hole in there. Is it a horse? It's a horse brass, methinks. Oh. Yeah, some sort of horsey type decoration. Well, the landowner would be happy because he's got horses. Right, I'll give this a bit of a scrub up and we'll see what it is a bit better since so it's got anything on the, the middle bit. Oh, there we go, my lovers. It is just a bit of a horse brass. It might have been silver plated at one time. Horse decoration. It would have been shining bright gold colour when the brass was all polished up. Right, on to the Ooh, next. Look at this signal here, my lovers. It's really sweet. It's a bit of an odd shape though. It might be a coin on its side. Oh, is that it? That's it. And it is... I don't know what. I don't know, some sort of button? Possibly a button. It's aluminium. Unfortunately, not silver. Oh, look at this lovely sweet signal I got here. Oh, it's a bit shallow. I wonder if I can get it with my pinpointer. Oh, it's looking a bit on the big side. <laughs> oh, still down there. Must be quite big. something. Oh, there's something there. It's actually quite big. Oh dear, wonder what that is. Oh. I think I'm going to need a bigger hole. Here it comes. Oh. I thought it was going to be full of gold coins, but it doesn't look like it. It's some sort of old ceramic pot. 
Got anything on it? Nope. Right. Oh, that was just bits of it. Of course, I think I might be on to my first coin after an hour. I put money on that being a coin. Right, I reckon it's going to be a coin because I'm near the fence. And anybody clambering over the fence is more likely to drop coins. Or, more likely to drop kakapoo poo. Oh. Let's have a quote closer look just in case it's silver. No, I don't think it's silver. I think it's kakapoo poo. -poo. Oh. Yeah, it's not full of gold coins. Ugh. Oh, this is one of the weirdest gardens I think I've ever done. I've not had a single coin yet. How about a nice Bronze Age axe head? I doubt it very much. I think it's the other half of that inch. Ugh. Still, it's a nice big chunk of bronze. That'd go well me scrapped in. Go oh, look at this here, my lovers. I think it might be my first coin. It's a bit shallow, so it might be modern. To pee or not to pee? No, it's not a coin. It's a pesky buckle. That's quite an old one. Probably still works, look. It does. You probably still use that. Oh, is there any writing on it? No, no maker's mark. Oh, I reckon I got a coin here. Look, it's right next to the path. It's got to be a coin. Look how tight it is. That's got to be a coin. Oh, oh, older looking soil. Is it a coin? Or is it something else entirely? Let's just make sure. That's what it was. But it don't look like no coin that I've ever come across before. Oh, looks like it might be quite old. Well, this is the place to look, I'm up nearer the house. Right, I'll get this cleaned up, I'll give it a little bit of a scrub. What's it made of? Lead? It might be a whirly gig. Yep, that's what I think it is, my lovers, it's a whirly gig. It's got two holes in it, it's got no marks on it. You used to put string through them and you twist them up and they'd make a noise when you were unravelling them. Right, oh, I, think I might have my first coin. Oh, 
There won't be a coin. Oh! That's it. It's not another whirly gig, is it? I think it's a measuring weight made of lead. For measuring things. Let's give it a quick rub on the trousers, see if any detail comes up. No. But that's what I think it is. Right, I'm into a hot spot of old stuff here now, my lovers. I've found it eventually. And it's right near the house. Someone only about 20 feet from the house. It's a modern house, so it's been um, built. You would think that the garden would be full of old bricks and lead from building work and trash, but nope, just here it's perfect. Oh, look at this thing I just dug up, my lovers. Looks like it's made of lead. Now, you would think it was some sort of pipe, but it's not got any holes in it that I can see. Look, that's, don't go anywhere. And that's flat, look, there's no hole there. Seems to be a bit of a hole there. But the rest of it, it sort of looks a bit chewed up there. But yeah, it's lead. What's that? Bizarre. Is it a key? You wouldn't make a key out of lead, it would bend. Don't know what that is. Strange. Oh, I've done it, my lovers, I've done it. I have found a coin. It's taken me four hours. And there it is. It is a spendable penny. Ugh. A spendable penny. Ugh. Right, I'm going to pack up soon. It's getting dark. Oh well, never mind. Better luck next time. Oh, look at this signal I got here. Dropped coin, 2p or not 2p? Right, it's in your. Oh, no, it's not two pence. It is a rather large. Oh, it's a box. Well, I wonder if it's got any gold coins in it. There's the hinge. What's left of the hinge? Is it going to open? Right, let's see if I can get this thing open. I don't think it's heavy enough for a large gold doubloon. Right, you have to get something to wedge it open. We've managed to ease it open. I haven't opened it yet, but it's, I've eased it. Oh, oh, what's that? It's like a powder. Let's have a sniff. Don't smell of anything. Ugh, it's all pasty. What's that then? Is that going to be some sort of compact for making um, making your face look whiter? Possibly. Ugh, now that can go back in there. Oh, what a shame. Well, it wasn't filled full of gold coins. Ugh, ugh, it's all pasty. Right, on to the next. Right, that's it, my lovers. I'm off home for some jars of ale. Red diesel. Cheers. Gently drops the rain I have never had But one true love In Greenwood he lies slain I'll 
do so much for my true love.